Hi guys, Keegan here with Champion Helmets, and today we'll be taking a closer look at the Shark Spartan Carbon by putting it to the test on the road. The Spartan Carbon is a popular touring helmet from Shark, and it features a somewhat sport-oriented design. Price-wise, it comes below the Race R Pro, but above the Carbonless Shark Spartan, at around 370 euros or 420 US dollars at its recommended retail price. It will be interesting to see how this mid-range touring helmet performs out on the road. If you want to see our dedicated review of the Shark Spartan Carbon, or if you want to check out any of our other road tests, then please head on over to our YouTube channel where you can check out our review and road test playlists. But before we get started, I'm gonna quickly take you over the more general features of this helmet. Quite simply, it is the carbon version of the Shark Spartan, it comes in two shell sizes, and that shell is made out of, guess what? Yeah, it's carbon and a little bit of fiberglass, but I guess that name wasn't quite as catchy. Either way, it is very durable and light, coming in at a weight of only 1,300 grams. So yeah, it is a very light helmet. That visor creates a nice tight seal against the shell, and it does come pinlock prepared with that pinlock included in the box. And you'll also find a drop-down sun visor controlled with a slider on the top of the helmet there, and that sun visor does drop nice and low to help keep that sun out of your eyes while you ride. Certainly a nice addition. Finally jumping on the bike, let me quickly point out the monitors we'll be using to track our data. On the left you find a white monitor, which is connected to a sensor at the top of our rider's head to track the internal temperature of the helmet. In the middle on the top, we have a decibel meter with that sensor sitting between our rider's head and the lining to track the noise inside the helmet. On the right, you can track the wind speed, and finally, in the middle on the dashboard, you can see the speed of travel in kilometers per hour and the outside temperature. As I mentioned previously, the Spartan Carbon is a touring helmet. During the test, our rider found the helmet to be both comfortable with a good lining and also found it to perform well at speed. He thought the ventilation performed well, but did think the helmet was a little bit noisy. So let's find out if our data backs up his comments. Data for the Spartan Carbon was collected while traveling at an average speed of 130 km per hour down long stretches of highway, with the wind speed fluctuating between 125 and 130 km per hour. The outside temperature during the test was about 20 degrees Celsius, and during the ride the internal temperature of the helmet was a little bit below 22 degrees Celsius, so a fairly small difference from the temperature outside, showing that the vents on the chin bar and the top of the helmet do do a pretty good job. As for noise isolation, the decibel meter showed an average of 104 decibels, which is rather loud, and does confirm our rider's comments about it being a fairly noisy helmet. Now that we have all our data, I'll take you through how we rate this helmet across our six categories. It earns three and a half stars in the material category, losing some marks for only offering two shell sizes. But it does receive a full five stars for its weight because it is remarkably light. The visor receives four stars, while its decent ventilation earns three stars. Its rating does take a hit due to its poor noise isolation, earning only two stars in that category, but it does earn some points back thanks to its four-star comfort. At its recommended retail price of 370 euros, each star costs only 17 euros, which is pretty good bang for your buck. Overall, we rate the Spartan Carbon three and a half stars out of five. If you're interested in purchasing the Shark Spartan Carbon, then head on over to our website at championhelmets.com where you can view that product page, read a full description of the Spartan Carbon, and view the product bundles we have available. So, in the end, what have we learned? Well, overall, the Shark Spartan Carbon does perform reasonably well. Its noise isolation isn't great, but it does ventilate well and performs well in all of our other categories. So overall, what you're getting is a pretty good helmet, and you're getting it for a pretty good price. Remember, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. I'll be sure to answer those for you. And if you like this video, please subscribe to our channel for more content. Once again, my name's Keegan with Champion Helmets, and I hope to see you again soon.